Yo guys, what's going on? In today's GTA Online video, I'm going to be showing you guys this cool little trick where you can make helicopters go faster than jets. The only other jets in the game that you won't be able to beat or you'll be very close to beating in speed would be the Stalin and the Pyro. But with all out of the way guys, let's jump straight into it. The first requirement for this is to own a hangar and the last requirement is to own a helicopter in that hangar. A nice trick that you can do is just phone up Pegasus and then drive a helicopter of your choice from Pegasus into your hangar. For example, a Savage, like you can't own the salvage normally but you can drive it into your hangar so that you technically own it then but once you guys have got them simple requirements done all that you want to do now is just hop in the helicopter that you want to drive for example i'm just going to take the akula here once you're in that helicopter that you want to fly out that's all you want to do you just want to go ahead and fly out your hangar once you guys spawn outside your hangar in the helicopter of your choice that is literally it if you're in a helicopter like the akula which can rise quite fast then don't hold the accelerator button all the time what i recommend doing to get the most speed is getting a bit of altitude first then pressing the brake button a few times. This will make the helicopter go down and then all that you want to do then is hold the accelerator button again for about a couple more seconds. This is all I do when flying helicopters in general anyway to make them go fast enough but for some reason helicopters when you take them out the hangar they get a massive increase in speed. Like if you guys look down at my mini map now you'll see how fast we're actually traveling. You guys can also tell that there's a massive speed boost because I'm going to show you now that I can actually outrun rockets by literally flying in almost a straight line and just literally stay into one side that's how i know that this is faster than the jet for example a laser because i know if you fly in a straight line with the laser then a missile will definitely catch you up and destroy you i'm pretty sure it's the same in the pyro as well but i'm not too sure but this is the part where some guy just literally locked onto me for no reason so i thought what better time to actually test the speed of this it was a mark 2 as well he was locking onto me so as you can see in the video i literally like angle myself in a weird way so i'm like almost turning very slightly to the left you can literally hear the beeping sound of him locking onto me from the start but none of the rockets can actually catch up to me or anything which is honestly just mad because usually if you're flying a straight line on this game you, you're gonna die if somebody locks onto you like that one thing to be wary of and look out for on the map would be the Chernobog though because the missiles that the Chernobog fires are so much more faster than the actual normal missiles and everything else and they're a lot more accurate but I'm still not sure if they can actually catch up though even the missiles from the Mark II oppressor don't really even come close normally if it was a bit closer then you'd see it on my screen or something like near the tail of my helicopter but we literally just can't see anything now i'm just going to be putting my cooler back in the hangar and i'm just going to be bringing out the hunter this time which i'm pretty sure is the fastest helicopter in the game but i'm not too sure i've done this little speed like trick before with the hunter and done this and it just feels ridiculous if i'm being honest like once again you can literally just see how fast we're going here and with the hunter's firepower as well nothing can really compete the only way you could possibly get caught out with this is by maybe turning around or something and then a Mark II comes, or maybe a jet. As you probably heard from the video, somebody did try and lock onto us, but we're literally just going way too fast. I'm not sure if it was like a homing launch on the ground or something, which would make more sense as to why it locked off so fast. But that's going to wrap it up for this video, guys. I will be leaving the rest of this little gameplay of me just flying the Hunter around, just so that you can see how fast it actually is. So yeah, guys, definitely try it out. Be sure to leave a like if this is something new and you didn't know. Also, feel free to comment down below, as your feedback is very appreciated. And don't forget to subscribe subscribe and hit that bell icon to stay up to date with more GTA Online content. Finally guys, thanks for watching.